I got like rug burn on my arm knee like four months ago and it's still freaking dark there. I think I got a scar from rug burn. What the hell is an arm knee? That thing. That's... <sighs> it's a freaking elbow. What's the word for horny but not in a sexual way? Like, I'm horny for Halloween but I don't want to screw a pumpkin, you feel me? Do, do you mean excited? Dude, imagine if you could screenshot real life. Camera. That thing you're talking about is a camera. Imagine if worms had legs. Centipedes. Today, I forgot the name for cauliflower, so I call that albino broccoli. That's actually not that far off. So we have an Italian exchange student in our school, and he and I were hanging out, and he saw a pony. He tried to show me, but he didn't know what it was called. So he just pointed at it and said, Look, the compressed horse! And then he just grinned at his complete understanding of the English language. That's precious. Dad just said, there should be a Netflix for books. Five minutes later, he shouted, <gasps> the library. I was talking to my boyfriend, and I was trying to describe a type of marine animal, but I couldn't think of its name, so I said, sea pancake, manta ray. Manta ray is the word I was looking for. I couldn't think of the word for tea, so I said England water. I just remembered that one time I was high and referred to Hamlet as the Fresh Prince of Denmark. What if snakes had tiny little arms and legs, like, oh, my French god! So apparently those are called lizards. There are two types of people. I am literally the only one who commented on this. There should be, like, feelings hookers. Like, you hire one to come to your house, and they sit there for an hour and listen to you cry about your life, then afterwards you pay them a hundred bucks, and then you never see each other again. How perfect would that be? That's a therapist! That's the thing you just described! Like, for realsies! Coke and therapy! Did the sign survive the Titanic? Yes to Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Capricorn, Sagittarius, Aquarius, and Pisces. And no to Leo. Having a picture of your girlfriend as the lock screen on your phone is the 21st century equivalent of keeping a locket with her picture in it. This is actually such an adorable comparison. Not if you watch School Days! I'm getting flashbacks, man! Instead of desexualizing women's Halloween costumes, we should sexualize men's costumes and make it equal. I want boys in underwear and cat ears. I like your style, kid! Good non-gendered words to say instead of dude to someone who doesn't want to be called a dude. Buddy, bud, pal, neighbor, mate, Partner? Don't forget. Comrade. Mortal. Boring and disrespectful. Oh, I can't survive without my morning coffee. Energy drinks make it so that I can get through my boring work and so on. Living properly. Treating caffeinated beverages like very mysterious and powerful magical potions that give us unforeseen abilities. Dude, 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 drink 15 cups of coffee in a day and you can clip through walls. Potion seller. I'm going into battle and I require your strongest potion. Phantom Macchiato plus five shots as usual then? F me up. Get me that knowledge juice, mage! W welcome to Dunkin' Donuts. Do you ever just sit there and wonder what life must be like for people without anxiety? Like, they just do things without worrying about them first. Wow! Anxiety is an excuse. I hope you walk barefoot on a world of Legos for the rest of your life! This is the chemical formula for love. Dopamine, serotonin, oxytocin. It can be easily manufactured in a lab, but overdosing on any of them can cause schizophrenia, extreme paranoia, and insanity. Let that sink in. Dude, that's so fricked up. Dude, that's my chemical romance. I went to the farmer's market yesterday, and at the Honey Guy's booth, there were all these bees just hanging out. Checking out the beeswax tabs, floating around the honey jars, not being aggressive, just really gentle and investigating or something. I don't know how bees work. And as he was giving me a sample of the wildflower honey, one of them landed on his hand, and he just took a drop from the jar and dabbed it onto his hand for the bee. And when I asked if they were his bees, he said, no, but they show up every time I come out. I think they just know my truck. And this guy is well known among the local bees and lets him sit on his hand and eat his honey. And I really, really just like this bee guy. Dude, what more of an endorsement could you help for? I don't want to alarm you, but you met a freaking forest nymph. Squidward literally lives in a deluxe three-floor loft. And he's a cashier. Squidward must be on back page selling ass. Dude, SpongeBob's crib got like ten rooms, a library, and a baby grand piano. I'm starting to think the Krusty Krab is just a front. The Krusty Trap. <laughs>
I mean, it is shaped like a lobster trap. Once I was walking home with some law school friends and they were like, why are you walking up that street? Your street is like three more streets up. Yeah, but there's a house on this street and sometimes their golden retriever naps in the sun on the sidewalk and I like to give him belly rubs. Now all the law students walk up belly rub lane because law school is stressful and dogs rock. And I bet that is the happiest dog. I'm trying very hard to live by cat principles. I am glorious above all things. I eat when hungry, sleep when sleepy, and play when bored. Affection is given and received on my terms and only mine. Show displeasure clearly. No! Demand the things you want. If they aren't given, demand them again, but louder this time. If you are touched when you don't want to be, say so. If they continue to touch you, make them bleed. I think cats are really onto something here. Since my stepdad cheated on my mom and he's being an ass, I put a crap ton of that tasteless powder laxative in all of his diet shake mixes. He won't notice until he shards himself and not be able to figure out why. Update, he soiled himself at Walmart and I haven't seen my mom laugh and smile that much for months. You are a hero! Oh my god, I'm at the grocery store and there's this guy in the frozen section who has tweaked off his balls on some kind of a hallucinatory drug. I'm in the next aisle meowing softly through the cereal boxes where he can't see me, and he is losing his mind pulling pizza boxes out of the freezer and yelling that he needs to save the popsicle cat. My bad person. August, September, Halloween, November, December. I think you mean August, September, Halloween, Turkey, Christmas. I believe it's sparrowed hot as balls, frick at school again, Halloween, Turkey, Christmas. Don't forget New Year's, forever alone, windy as frick. Crap, it's raining. Allergies. Oh, hey, it's actually decent. Wait, never mind. And a partridge in a pear tree. Man, humans are lame. Why do we have, like, wings and horns and whatever? Humans can't even handle having different skin colors. How well do you really think that would go? That's basically the plot of X-Men. Literally the plot of X-Men! F is for friends who do stuff without you. U is for uninvited. C is for clinging on to hope that you won't keep getting forgotten. K is for Krispy Kreme, yum. This is not what I wanted this post to turn out like. One time I got in the shower. It came out and no one was home and the lights were off. My entire family went bowling and forgot about me. Down here in the deep blue sea. Attention sarcasm users, we're being faced with a serious issue. There is only one sarcasm left. Now we've got to use it wisely. Please, for the love of God, think before you speak. It's gotta be good. Yeah, okay, I'll be sure to do that. Oh no, what have I done? I swear people get 500 times cuter when they talk about what they're passionate about. Unless it's Hitler. Then it's only nine times cuter. I am done! So I just realized something. Plastic dinosaurs, right? Plastic is made of oil, which comes from dinosaurs. Plastic dinosaurs are made of IRL dinosaurs. I... science has definitely come too far. How did you manage to spell dinosaurs differently three times? Do you ever get the urge to get up in the middle of the night while everyone else is fast asleep and just walk places and be completely alone and entirely dedicated to your thoughts? Yes, but the problem is I don't want to get murdered, you feel me? I feel you. We all feel you. Why are there so many people touching me? This is why you don't walk around in the middle of the night. So I can either bake these cookies at 400 degrees or 10 minutes or 4,000 degrees for one minute. Nick, no! That's not how you bake cookies, friend! Florid. Nick, no! What about 4 million degrees for one second? Nick, you're going to burn your house down! I'm going to harness the fuck son to make cookies. Nick, please! You're either the friend or the Nick. On the bright side, I'm not addicted to crack cocaine. On the downside, I'm too poor to afford one. One crack cocaine. Hello, drug dealer. Yes, I would like to purchase one crack cocaine, please. Debit or credit? I actually have a gift card. What if, like, there was an exact copy of you somewhere? Except they're the other gender. Like, you guys could literally have a freaky Friday moment and nothing would change. Imagine the best friendship that could be found there. I could literally go frick myself. Ah, oh, there's two types of people. Kill your doll. Apparently there are three. What color are mirrors? Let's reflect on this. 
Do you ever, like, go to put salt on your food and then find it odd that we sprinkle tiny pieces of rock on our food because we like how it tastes? Like, how freaking weird is that, am I right? I just realized we don't even know what dinosaurs sound like. They could have been speaking fluid German for all we know. It's too early for this late night tumbler. Guten Morgen, Herr Pterodactyl. Hey guys, I'm making French toast sticks in the oven. I'm gonna take a quick nap. Wake me up in five minutes so I can flip them over. Randy, it's been five minutes. Flip your sticks. <laughs> Randy, your sticks! How was that? Are your chakras all aligned now? Seeing John Mulaney do his robot test bit has given me a strong desire to see him play a live-action Riddler. But not like as any other character other than John Mulaney. Like, let's just make a John Mulaney version of Edward Digma. Just this socially awkward disaster man who somehow becomes a supervillain because of a misunderstanding he couldn't correct without seeming rude. And now supposedly he's committed to killing Batman, but he doesn't actually want to be the cause of a man's death, so he just affixuates things with clues and riddles and battles of wits until Batman inevitably defeats him, and he's just like, oh, thank God, please don't kill me. Batman's like, you need help, Nygma. And he's just like, yeah, that's fair. I should probably look into seeing somebody at this point. I became a supervillain because of social anxiety, and that just might be a red flag, you know? Hey, Batman. Think you've seen everything, huh? We'll figure out how to deal with this. You know, Gotham General Hospital? Yeah? Well, you'll never guess what I let loose in there. Riddle me this. What has four hooves and presents a massive health and safety violation? I see you there, Batman. And I also don't want me to be doing what I'm doing. Oh my god, I need this. I need this. I need this in my life. Somebody give me a John Mulaney Riddler, please. Okay, okay, Animal Crossing. You can stick 17 refrigerators in your pocket. But god forbid you put a fish in a letter. That's just crazy! Why the frick is Sherlock Holmes' brother named Microsoft? No, 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 wrong. His name isn't Microsoft. That would be ridiculous. His name's Minecraft. Actually, no, it's mitochondria, the powerhouse of Great Britain. What are your resolutions for the new year? Ah, eh, 1080p. Back to hell with you! Projected timeline of global warming. 2030, the ice we skate is getting pretty thin. 2100, the water's getting warm, so we might as well swim. And 2250, my world's on fire! How about yours? God, these sexuality gender type flags are stupid, and apart from the gay one, no one cares what they mean. That, that's the Welsh flag. Gender of the day, Wales. My fellow people, today we have a new abbreviation. LGBTW, lesbian, gay, bisexual, trans, and finally Welsh. Anyway, here's Wonderwall. Why is your ukulele so big? I feed it well. If you bite it and you die, it's poisonous. If it bites you and you die, it's venomous. What if it bites me and it dies? That means you're poisonous. Jesus Christ, Nate, learn to read. What if it bites itself and I die? It's voodoo. What if it bites me and someone else dies? That's correlation, not causation. What if we bite each other and neither of us die? That's kinky. Oh my god! How chicks put on lipstick. I can't stop seeing the beaks' his mouth, so all of them are just... Aah! I thought these were grapes. Why would grapes need to put on lipstick? To feel beautiful. How to cheer up in two easy steps. Whisper beep boop to yourself. Repeat until not sad. But why does this work? Plug your nose. Say steep stop. Try saying boopity doop in a really deep manly voice. So today I got physically removed from an oligarch for eating too many breadsticks. How many did you eat? All of them. GET OUT NOW! There's just- there's so many freaking layers of obscurity to this joke. I feel like I've learned another language by just looking at it. God, this one's amusing. That feel when you help a friend with some family issues and only realize after the fact that he's gonna light you on fire as a result. I may have made a mistake! Midori Izuku, 2017. It was the best mistake you have ever made for me. Todoroki Shoto, 2017. Your expression is not reassuring me about how much pain I'm about to be in! Midori Izuku, 2017. Sweat dropping. XT! Does that satisfy people's needs of having me do a Deku impression? Because on Tumblr, I got that request a lot. Alright, this is a meme call out post. Chungus is just a Fruit Loop Cat reskin. Try to change my mind. I definitely am going to start practicing self-care more. I did it. 
I achieved inner peace. I achieved inner peace twice. For the record, I did actually eat a character do this bit. <laughs> so what was your favorite ending game? Oh, uh, you know, uh, Death Strikes Away, but it... Nut Dealer? If you had the power to envision hell, what would it be like? Okay, so you know that moment when you're finally tucked in for bed, everything is shut off, and you're on the brink of sleep, when suddenly you have to go to the bathroom? That moment, but for all eternity. What people think D&D is going to be like, versus what D&D is actually like. Apparently I made some people mad on Tumblr because I compared D&D to Goblin Slayer, but let me tell you something, it's not that far off. Also, I could have put in Konosuba, but I forgot. List of words, the internet has changed for me forever. Random, stand, basic, thick, top, bottom, daddy, mommy, little, and feel free to add more. Benedict Cumberbatch, did you mean Sherlock Strange the Dragon, who is also a Grinch? All right, Tumblr, explain your gender in 10 words or less without using boring words like male, female, non-binary, masculine, feminine, or androgynous. Go. Rolling around at the speed of sound. My dad works for Nintendo, so you should just let me win and smash. Reblog if you support this hardworking single mom and her kids. She worked herself to the bone. <laughs> now, PM, you didn't try to waifu or a husbando or anyone again, did you? No, sir. Then explain this! Is that what you think? She's a queen. Oh, no. What have I done? In case nobody told you, I hope you all have a great day and that it's free of any new pussycat. What's new pussycat? Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's new pussycat? I have never in my life have ever gotten that to work. <laughs>